Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video from Ling Ling. Today I'm still here in the beautiful Sujo settings. Well, a small town outside of Sujo, but still in the Sujo area. Um, today we're going to talk about the five things that I think is really annoying Chinese people do. But before we get started, I want to remind you that I'm not saying every single Chinese person do this. It's most commonly seen in the smaller towns in China or between elder people. But still, it's also happening in Beijing and there are some things I just really don't like Chinese people do. So yeah, let's get into this little video. The first thing I don't like Chinese people do is the spitting. Spitting, spitting, spitting. I know that in one of the other videos I said that I also do it sometimes, but only if it's really, really necessary. I especially hate it when they do it inside. It's most commonly like elder men who do it and it's disgusting. The second thing I don't like is the smoking inside the restaurants. It is much better in Beijing, but it's still happening in many places. Again, very often the elder men. Yeah, I don't like that, the smoking inside the restaurants. Also younger men in the smaller towns. So the tourists who just arrived, it doesn't seem like they want to leave again. So I'm just gonna come a little closer to the camera. <laughs> so the third thing I really don't like Chinese people do um, is in the bathroom. Um, they're cheating in the queue, especially the Lao Ai, the, the, the aunties, you know. They're cheating, they're cheating and when I, when I really have to pee, I hate it. So I'm standing nicely in the queue, even though like maybe I'm the only one in the queue. But then they're just gonna like walk in front of me and then take the bathroom that's free in the second they come out the other, the girl who just finished and it's so ah, annoying. I hate that, I really hate that. Especially if I really have to pee or if I have a bad stomach. <laughs> so that's the third thing. <laughs> The fourth thing I really don't like is in the subway, the pushing and squeezing. I'm getting more used to it and I listen to my music and I try to just, you know, not care about it, but it's still freaking annoying. Especially some people because I'm always changing at the end stop from one line to another. So basically what happens is that everyone is just standing in front of the opening, right? And then when it opens, people are just like pushing in and I'm just like, okay, whatever, I'm going with the flow. But then I realized some people, they stop in front of the door because they can see that there are no more seats available. Yes, guys, they're not moving to the side not moving to the side, they're standing straight in front of the door so the people behind them, me, cannot get in. And I don't mind standing up for three stops. Some people, they really, really take this, take a get a seat thing very seriously. Very, very seriously. So this is the fifth thing I really hate about China, <laughs> is that people are just so intense when it comes to getting a seat. It's like, the mission of a lifetime in the buses and the metro and it's just like pushing 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 but again as i'm saying it's very often the old aunties or like people from smaller towns or from the outskirt of town <clears throat> Uh, the young people just like me who studied at university and lived an urban lifestyle they don't seem to be in such a rush and they seem to be okay by standing up <laughs> during the metro ride so yeah those are the five things that I really really don't like Chinese people do anyways thank you guys for watching this little video from this temple um, maybe I should show you guys the temple before I'm leaving you to it there we go Mm, cute and another little one in the back here oh the tourist left now how cool is that yeah so guys thank you for watching my little video here from the temple i hope you're having a great day evening wherever you are in the world please give me a thumbs up subscribe for more videos from ling ling and i'll see you again very very soon ling ling is out see ya and bye bye